Famous women inventors. Oh, good. good. Are you actually going to uh, learn something and not talk out of your ass? This oh, should be absolutely. Good. Yeah, this is going to be a quick this read. This should be good. This is going to be a quick read. <laughs> no, it's not, actually. Look at all these people here. It's like 12 names. You're going to fall. Hey, everyone. It's Pluto. Make sure you like and subscribe and go follow my Patreon. It's only $5 a month and you get an extra video every week. Well, I want to announce that I may have found the dream boy of the decade. He's sexy, sassy, and full of spunk. His name is Timmy. Timmy! Uh, this one is Bilber and Nia, and it's a hilarious fight over female inventors. Shut the door. Uh, get me some water, though. Come back. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Yes, you're. I'm a man. I asked you to do something. You're a woman. You go and you do it. And you don't ask questions. Bill, I swear to God. Ah, oh, God. So anyway, it's like oh, I was saying. So they're sitting there bitch moaning and complaining about all the stuff they don't have, but we... Really? You, you know, and it's like, you fucking outlive us. Really? You outlive us. What are you giving me water for in a shot glass? <laughs> Come on, Nia, don't be a douche. Oh my God. Well, you know what? You have a birthday coming up. I know exactly what I'm getting you. Big bag of Fritos. You're an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Put it in the juice glass. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. All right, so anyways. Yeah, so they're always bitch moaning and complaining about what they don't have, right? You know, do they ever look around and see what they do have? A whole f platoon of shoes oh huh, that their guy paid for. I'll tell you what I have. Right? Douchebag for a husband. Oh, snap. 12 to 6 right there, baby. Hey, Nia, do you know why I make more an hour than you? Because I'm better than you. Because oh. I'm worth more than you. Oh my gosh. Think about it, Nia. Think about all the great inventions. Think about all the great stuff that makes your life simple. Has a broad invented one of them? No. Has any of them? Stop running their yap for more than three seconds to even invent the fucking can opener. Oh my gosh. You know what? That's actually a great question. Let's go to broadinventions.org. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see what the ladies, women, inventors. Okay. I'm going to tell. Oh, what did you guys invent? Skippy peanut butter. <laughs> Marie Curie. Huh? You know what? Your mic's turned down for a reason. All right, here we go. He's so women lame. inventors. <laughs> here we you go. You are so lame. Do you know famous? How, do famous. You know how fucking lame you are with this fucking premise that you have been. I know. I know. I know how for the fat last I am. Ten years of your career. <laughs> your mic's back on. You've been squeezing this dumb premise dry for the last 10 years of your career. What are you, you having for time breakfast? To move on? Get what kind of having breakfast? Time to move on? What are you having for breakfast? A nice big bowl of feminism. Yeah, well, you know what? <laughs> that that f uh, chauvinism paid for that f bowl of feminism. Famous women inventors. Oh, good. good. Are you actually going to uh, learn something and not talk out of your ass? This oh, should absolutely. Be good. Yeah, this is going to be a quick this read. This should be good. This is going to be a quick read. <laughs> no, it's not, actually. Look at all these people here. It's like 12 names. You're going to fall asleep before you get there. There's more the first guys on the Clippers on there. than there's f women inventors. Oh, Mary God. Anderson, Barbara Askins, that takes care of the A's. <laughs> <laughs> Patricia Billings, Marion Donovan, on one Sally website. Fox. Well, what the f? Oh, yeah. Leah, do you think I'm serious? Yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so good. Let's see. Mary Anderson, anyone who's ever driven in a rain or a snowstorm. You really need to get a new bit, though. Seriously. Can attest? <laughs> you really need to get a new bit. What are you talking about? Uh, you know what I'm talking about. What? Try I didn't trash women once my last special. You're <laughs> I My didn't. Last special. But what's happening right now? You still coming way? You circling the wagon back around to the same guy? It's, I have the sniffles. I don't feel good. <laughs> no. This is comfort You're food for me. Oh, oh my this God. is comforting to you? Oh, you know what? You know something? This is comforting oh, 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 wait, that wait, is wait. So wait. sad. Wait, wait. Okay, Miss Enlightened. Miss Enlightened. <laughs> yes. What did What did Mary Anderson? They're so bickery, but it's so cute. Like they're little roasts. Like, oh, okay, okay. And then she has like her. 
I think the energy that she gives him has probably developed from being with him for so long. I don't want to take credit from her, probably just naturally also being funny. I mean, I don't know her, I can't just assume. But that does happen to couples all the time where a lot of things kind of just start morphing and meshing together. And since he is a comedian, I would think that that's probably why she kind of combatively comes at him in a very similar witty way that he has his own comedy. I think that she's really similar. You can even hear it in this podcast how she like retorts him or responds and whatever she comes out with to say. It sounds really similar to Bill Burr. Miss Enlightened? Yes. What, did, what did Mary Anderson invent? I don't know. Oh, I never yeah? claim to know. What did Barbara women? Askins invent? I don't know. The post-it. <laughs> Is that true? No. Oh. How about Patricia Billings? I don't. I, you I, call I, yourself a feminist and you don't know your starting lineup. That's not. This is, I, are you already naming the Patriots offensive line? Because I'll I, do it. No, I really don't. Sally Fox. Is this the starting do lineup? anything regarding sports. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what. I, just because I'm, that doesn't mean that I would know every female. That doesn't make any sense. But you're you, not, you, you don't. You don't know any of them. Didn't how about Marie how about Curie Beth Nesmith something? Graham? Did Marie Curie invent Doct something? I'm going to name up all the names on this list, and I want you to tell me what one of them did. Doctor Temple Grandin. Oh, oh yes, uh, she was the woman who invented the thing for cows. So when they were going to slaughter, they wouldn't be freaking out. Oh, is that like, the girl on the TED Talk? Pressurized thing that's on them. I think she's she autistic. Had like autism or something like that. You got some of it. She the would, thing that usually amazes yeah, people yes. about. Most about prolific woman inventor Dr. Temple Grandin is not all the great strides she has made to improve animal handling devices. You nailed it. Yeah. Nor the fact that she earned a PhD in animal science. Hmm. Why is that amazing? Uh, you know what? That, you are such so a fucking douchebag. You <laughs> can't give it up even when it's in front of your face in black and white. Like, I'm well, I don't like how when you guys... I'm sick of you. <laughs> why when you guys do that we do it's suddenly amazing you know what goodbye I'm you guys drove a garbage, garbage truck and you're laying you drove a goddamn garbage truck down the street to be a lifetime movie oh my gosh the ah. premises that you've been doing for the last 10 years oh you shut up you know, like you. you know i like you you know i like you come on you know i you're like being a you. baby about this i'm not being a baby you're being a hey, jerk i'm breaking my balls you're getting all fresh down there i uh i know who she is because there's an hbo movie about it Starring oh, there you go. Starring God Claire knows Baines. you can't sit down and read. All right. Really, so though? What was the last evil. book you, you read? And Stephen Adler's biography doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> I think that might have been the last one. <laughs> I read Let's the see, uh, Fairy it, 2014 funny. book. Um, <laughs> oh, my gosh. 2014. All right, whatever. So, you know, so they, you guys, you, know, you got a nice little list here. <laughs> What? I can't believe you felt the need to go online as if to somehow wait. Did women invent things? Like, what is wrong Do with women? you? You, I really have to keep asking that question. Hey, is it because you're Mia. a 46 year old white man from Boston? Like, is it? Can I really just distill it down to your 46? stats? Can I ask you a question, Nia? No, you can't. I want you to name some women inventors. Temple Graydon. <laughs> I keep saying Marie Curie. Didn't she invent? Something? Yeah, you're talking all this. Like I can't believe blah 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 blah. blah. But you don't I, even have the you don't even have the bullets in your gun. You're over there. You're, you're I, shooting I, I, blanks. I don't need bullets to have in bullets in my. Gun. I know you don't. All you gotta do is start enough. bitching, and everybody listens to you. Because I'm smart enough to know. you're a broad. Yeah. You're the one going online like a you're prehistoric. Broad. Don't blow your nose into the microphone, Jesus. How are you still sick anyway? Hey, listen. Just because I'm up all night trying to find something you guys did. <laughs> If anybody takes this seriously, go f yourselves. You know somebody's going to take a little clip of this and send it to some clam bake f site, and I'll get in trouble. What is clam bake? Clam -bake? Yeah, whatever the they are. Clam bake. Oh my God! Let's just You're focus. Really this, let's just focus on the next. Yeah, I swear to God, when I went to India and I saw that toddler take it between two park cars, that f I don't. That sad. Yeah, I don't want to hear people complaining. What? Oh, okay, that's just sitting point. there with a brooch. You're wearing a brooch. That's more than that kid will ever have. I love his sense of humor. I feel like it's really sense of, uh, it's really similar to mine. I mean, I'm not funny, but I think that everything that he says, for some reason, at least hits with me to where he is. I mean, I would hate to say my favorite, because then all the Dave Chappelle fans will be like, "Hey, <laughs> can't pick favorites." But um, yeah, there's something just really special about Bill Burr. I find him really funny, and I really like his relationship with Nia. It's, it feels 
really just great and even kind of comforting that they seem so good together. See, she's not just some like a wife that he has that he doesn't even really talk to. Like they seem really cool and really chill together. And I'm really happy for both of them. But if you haven't already, make sure you like and subscribe. I plan on doing more of these podcasts in the future. They're so much fun and uh, they definitely set a different tone. So if you want to see more, make sure you set the notifications on. Um, go check me out on Patreon for more videos that you have not seen. And I will see you next time. Bye.